In today's video, I want to talk about GCash. Uh, this is not a sponsored video. Gusto ko lang siya pag-usapan kasi it makes my life more convenient and easier. And I think isa siya sa mga mobile phone app ko na dumadalas yung paggamit ko. So I want to talk more about it in this video. If there's an app that would lead yung Philippines into a cashlesser society, it would probably be GCash. And here's why. First, let's talk about the two major uses ng GCash para sa akin. Siguro number one reason ko why I like GCash is it, is it allows me to transfer to almost any bank with minimum to no charges. Dami kong friends that ask me favor to transfer money for them to other banks kasi they only have either BDO or BPI. And pagka magte-transfer sila to interbank, may charges sila. So they ask me favor and binibigay ko naman favor nila. I help them out, I transfer the money for them, then in return, ibabalik nila dun sa account ko kung anong meron silang bank. Every time na nangyayari yun, I remind them na mag-download na lang sila ng GCash because it will allow them to transfer money to almost any bank with almost no charges or minimum charges. And isa pang magandang uh, nagagawa ng GCash is, is it also allows you to transfer money from GCash account to another GCash account. So, pwede din yun. Another main use ng GCash para sa akin is as a mode of payment. Whenever I buy something sa Lazada, I usually use GCash as the mode of payment kasi it allows me to use yung GCash 10 na promo code nila. And madalas gumagana naman yun. Kaya lang may cap siya na 100 but it's fine, discount pa din yun. Then another na gusto kong nagagawa niya para sa akin is pagka nasa mall ako, I usually don't bring much cash. Siguro pang pamasay ko lang para makauwi ako ng bahay and makalis ako ng bahay yun na yung dinadala ko. And... Dahil doon, dahil sa GCash, dahil nga may mga QR na yung mga establishment sa mall, I could buy or pay yung mga establishment sa yun with just GCash. So, hindi ko na kailangan pumila pa ng mahaba sa mga ATM machines outside para mag-withdraw ng pera. So, yun. I mean, so win-win. Other features that are worth mentioning is yung buying a load. So, dito hindi ka lang limited to load yung Globe and TM. Pwede ka din mag-load ng Smart, tapos Sun, and Talk and Text. Pero yung advantage mo, if uh, yung, yung mobile number mo is under ng Globe and TM, mayroon kang 5 pesos rebate every time na naglo-load ka. So, maganda dito, hindi lang siya basta yung regular load. Pwede ka din yung may go sakto na, yung may pang surf, yung may pang all-in, go only, ganun. May pang broadband na din, uh, pay TV, signal packages, health insurance. So, it's a, like good thing na meron to. Another feature na gusto ko is yung bills payment. So, hindi mo na kailangan pumila sa mga bills payment center sa mga malls or sa mga establishments. You can do it with just your phone. So, dito meron sila through electric utilities, water utilities, cable internet, telco, credit cards, loans, government, insurance, transportation, real estate, healthcare, schools, payment solutions. So, almost everything covered na nung bills payment nila. Last na tingin kong usable for me is yung Booking movies, so meron lang silang mga extra charges doon, uh, parang yung booking fee, uh, convenience fee, ganun. But ito yung ginamit ng kapatid ko when they watch Avengers, so siya yung nag-book nun para sa mga friends niya and sa kanya. And hindi siya nabusan ng seat dahil dito. Dami niya pang ibang features, pero yung mga binanggit ko is yung mga personally na ginagamit ko para sa GCash. Uh, I suggest itry mo siya, explore yung app na yun, because it will definitely make your life more convenient and easier. I uh, just want to ask feedback uh, kung sino man nakapanood nito. Uh, I want to know ano pa yung gusto yung laman ng videos ko. Is it more sa personal finance, uh, mga under investments, or insurances, VULs, uh, pag naman sa or filmmaking, kung gusto nyo din, pwede din filmmaking, uh, making YouTube videos, kung interested kayo dun. Or mga live stories. Pwede din yun, something na inspiring or about entrepreneurship. So yun, uh, your feedback would be appreciated. Uh, sobrang short nitong video na to. Siguro yung next video ko will be about uh, sa Binyag or sa Boracay. Hindi ko pa napas yung video ko about Boracay. Niisip ko pa kung ano yung uh, magiging thesis nun, kung ano yung story na gusto kong i-portray dun sa video na yun. Pero definitely, uh, this Sunday kasi may Binyag yung... Ah, uh, may binyag yung anak na kaklase ko nung college. So, I'll be attending yun as Ninong. And probably, I'll make a podcast about sa sacrament ang binyag and ano yung mga uh, talagang duties ng Ninong. Because ako, 
personally, I mean, I have Nino and Ninang, pero ano ba talaga yung uh, pinaka ano nila, work for purpose ba tayo kumukuha ng Nino and Nina? and that would be in my podcast and yun, I'll probably update then about dun sa podcast ko in the next video so that's this weekend so dun sa next video ko it will be linked below so if natawa ka in this video or you find this video informative uh kindly leave a like and if tingin mo this is worth your time subscribe na din yeah peace see you in the next video